Hey everyone! So it's Sunday, fun day. Actually, it's not really fun day for those who are going back to work tomorrow, right? Those who go back to work tomorrow, you guys generally hate Sundays. At least that's how it was for me. It was like, ugh, it's Sunday. My weekend just started and it just ended all at the same time. No fun! No fun. Anywho, so we have a box opening. And I'm going to shut a curtain over here because I feel like it's just giving me way too much sunlight. I mean, it did help with the video, but way too much sunlight. So, we are introducing a new baby into the collection. Yeah! I uh, have a few new babies joining the collection. I have one baby that, oh my gosh, it's by an amazing... An amazing, an amazing, an amazing artist. No, it's not Jackie. I know she's amazing. But it is by another amazing, amazing, amazing artist. But uh, I do have to keep it on the down low. She doesn't typically take customs very often. And uh, just I cannot say anymore. Super excited. So that baby will be paid off in the next month or so. And I am so excited. So yes. Let's get on to this box opening, though. This box opening is um, a baby that I created for myself. Um, I wish I was rich just to buy dolls from everybody and I wouldn't have to make my own babies. But, hey, let's face it. I do enjoy my own work a lot. So, um, you know, I make my own babies quite often. Sorry, I'm messing with some Funko Pops because I had, like, the Leaning Tower of Funko Pops ready to come crashing down any time. All right, so we've got a box opening. We've got super cute stuff for this baby. Oh, so cute. First is this super adorable outfit, which I could not find in my baby size at uh, Babies RS. It is Carter's, and they didn't have it at Carter's until yesterday I went there. But, however, I bought this at Marshall's for $9.99. It is so cute. This baby wears three-month size. It is a girl. I mean, I guess it could be a boy wearing pink. But this baby is a girl. It's a white tunic top with this cute pink little monster looking thingy. I don't know. And then it's got bright pink shorts that match. So adorable. Yesterday, I picked up this outfit for her as well at Carter's. I paid $4 for it because I did have a $10 off. So it's a um, three-piece jogger set, we'll say. It's a light cotton uh, jacket with pants bright blue with white hearts all over it and then it's got this beautiful onesie that has all these different colors of flowers all over it super cute that's gonna look really cute on her next i'm not sure if this is gonna fit her it does seem to run a little big on the three month size but we can definitely shrink it so it fits we'll have to wash it but i got this at ross it's one of the first cute mermaid outfits i have seen it's got a bib it says beautiful mermaid princess with the mermaid on there and her little castle and then look at the onesie is actually pretty cute typically when i buy these sets i don't even use the onesie but it is cute i just buy them for the sleeper um and then the sleeper is white with mermaids all over it look at that mermaids so cute so that got her i found this lovely set that um was given to me as a Christmas gift. I want to say it was given to me by Hello Melissa Sue. Not this Christmas, but the Christmas before. I haven't had a baby this size of a girl that could wear it. And if I did, it wasn't at the right time of the year. So I'm super excited. I put her in it because it is so cute. But um, I'll just show you what, you know, it's got. It's this Jimboree dress. It's got a Scotty dog on there. It says Peekaboo. So adorable so adorable and then we've got the uh velour uh <sighs> pajama set or you can use it as a romper because it's super nice uh that matches everything else it's got the little scotty dogs on the feet it is just way too cute and then she's wrapped up in the matching blanket so let's just go ahead and get her out of the box she's so cute guys her name is undecided right now they are voting on patreon for her name, it's between Matilda, Madeline, and Lola. Um, 
also, and it's a special spelling of Madeline. I found there's so many different spellings of Madeline, but I really like this one. Okay, so yeah, so if you guys are on Patreon and you want to vote for her name, you definitely should. But here we go. Look at the little Scotty dog on her cute velour blanket. And guess what, guys? She can wear the Uggs because she does have big feet. So her feet fit very well into these Uggs. Look at how cute that is. I mean, it is just so cute, the little Uggs on that baby. She's so adorable. So adorable. I'm trying to not show you guys her face. Um, okay, so her painting is amazing. Well, I mean, I did her painting, but you know, I think it looks very nice. Let me show you her feet. So when I said she has big feet, she does have very big feet. And her toes are separated, so she could wear like uh, sandals. She's got the half moon shape on her toes. Very sweet. Let's zoom in there just a little bit. Um, so I'll put that sock back on her. Yes. Put it back on her so her feet can stay warm. I need little pantyhose with this outfit. But I don't have any. And look at the bloomers on the dress. A red polka dot which matches the blanket and the dress the well obviously because it goes with the dress but the dress is the gray velour just like the blanket it's got the scotty dog there in the middle let's see her hand over here beautiful beautiful let me show you guys she's got the half moon shape going on there really sweet um let's see let's show you her other hand without showing her face oh sneak peek and here is her other hand. Look at that. So cute. Half moon shapes on her nails as well. Okay, are you ready? This kit is a very rare kit. Hard to find kit. I'll tell you what. I've seen this kit as a blank kit bid on eBay. Not once, not twice, a few times for well over $500. I paid $200. Uh, $250 for this kit. Yeah, $250 for this kit from Australia. From Albie Wenzel. Wetzel, Wenzel. I'm not for sure. Yeah. Thank you so much, Albie. I'm really excited to get my hands on this kit. She has full arms, full legs. And without further ado, let's see her cute little face. Oh, there she is. Look at her. So cute. So, for those of you who do not know, she is the Lizzie Sculpt by Adri Stowe Eddy. Like I said, very, very hard kit to find. Painted or blank. So, it was a it was, it was just perfect timing, I guess. Because I've been on the look for this kit secretly. I don't like to share a lot of the time the kits I'm looking for because... Then all of a sudden, a lot of people are looking for those kits. And uh, I like to just kind of, you know, be able to find something on my own special kit for myself. And, uh, yeah. So, it was perfect timing. I saw she commented somewhere she was selling it. I messaged her and I was like, I have to have that kit. I want it so bad. So, here she is. Here is Lizzie. So, she has... I gave her the look. She has painted hair, but my plan behind her painted hair was I wanted her to be a dark brown baby, kind of like myself when I was a baby. And my mom said I didn't really get hair until I was about two. I mean, of course I had hair, you know. We're not completely skinheads. We're not totally bald, you know, like a slick head, like when you shave your head. So I had hair. Um, but I wanted it to look like a baby whose hair is just coming in. So that's the look I went for with her. Um, so it's a very delicate painted hair and also guys she has top and bottom lashes like what I have started doing this on not all my open eye babies because it's definitely a extra expense feature but dolls that I'm putting on eBay I'm doing it on and dolls for myself I'm giving them the bottom and top rooted lashes so that's been a lot of fun to do. Let's pull away this red blanket. Sometimes that alters her color. Okay, there we go. She has beautiful blue glass eyes. These are from a private lady that I work with. 
and the eyes are from Russia, I believe. I'm pretty sure they're from Russia. This guy makes uh, prosthetic eyes for people who actually need eyes, and so he, um, she gets these eyes from him. And I'll tell you, it's very hard to deal with to get them from her, but Jackie has some way of always getting eyes from her. If I ask, I never get them. It's just so much confusion. So, yeah, so... That is my new sweet baby. She was born last night. Let's show everybody your beautiful face again. I'm super excited to have her in my collection. Her mouth is slightly open at the bottom. No, she can't take a modified pacifier, but she has the ability to take a magnetic pacifier. And I would show you if I had a magnet here or pacifier nearby. I don't. They're in the closet. I don't want to go get one because I'll leave you guys. So, yeah. So, welcome, my little baby. Those of you who have not voted on Patreon for her name, please head over there and vote for her name. I can't wait. It, right now it's running between Madeline and Matilda for her name. Lola's the low runner. But, um, yeah. So I hope you guys are excited to see this new baby. I can't wait to make more videos. I'm starting to feel a little better, so I think we'll be getting back into the video groove here very soon. All right, guys. Well, as always... Thank you so much for watching.